Hi, my name is Satchel and I'm the president of Yonder Deep. We're a student organization at UC San Diego working to develop a 3D printed autonomous underwater vehicle for climate change research. Our project focuses on collecting acoustic data of coffee bubbles and glaciers. We use our AV to collect data that's normally impossible for normal researchers, and we can go all the way up to the terminus of a glacier to collect high quality acoustic data. AUVs can cost upwards of tens of thousands to even millions of dollars, depending on their capabilities. Our aim is to change that and make affordable research more feasible for everyone. Um, that's why we're choosing to use 3D printing as a much more affordable process and material for uh, building something like an AUV. We also design our parts with 3D printing in mind. By using 3D printing, we can make our parts more complex, but also use fewer parts to make our overall design more efficient. We also design our AUV to be modular. This means we can adjust the sensors in a way that it can be applicable even in the cold waters of the Arctic and also in the warm waters of San Diego. One of the biggest advantages of 3D printing in our project is the fast turnaround times. Instead of waiting weeks on end on lead times for complex parts, we can make parts in-house within a day. Um, we've been using Ray 3 ds printers for a while now, um, probably around two years, and we just recently updated them with the hyperspeed upgrade, and it has completely changed our entire workflow. Um, we've only had it for about a month or so, um, but with the tight deadlines that we're often experiencing in terms of getting ready for a test or an open ocean, Deployment, a lot of times things will break and we'll need to reprint things very fast and the hyperspeed upgrade has been instrumental in that. Um, we actually recently just reprinted almost our entire AUV in probably a third of the time that it would have taken without the upgrade. Um, so it has been huge for our team and we were really amazed honestly. It has let us do a lot more, a lot quicker um, with in terms of printing 100% in full parts. So parts that used to take us upwards of sometimes even 70 hours for large parts like these full motors um, can now be bumped down to like 40, which is insane. 3D printing is incredibly important in education, especially in design. Having students learn how to think and manufacture in a way that's forgiving and also adaptable is incredibly important and beneficial. Um, 3D printing especially as a technology lets students explore new kinds of geometries and kind of instant creation that wouldn't have been possible beforehand and really lets us design and redesign kind of at an instant and decide where to go next for the project. We really appreciate Ray's 3D's commitment to investing in future generations and students like us with the 3D printers and that kind of technology. Um, it's really important for us in getting that kind of hands-on experience at school that we might not have gotten otherwise.